Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Today we're going to be taking a look at fixing your NVIDIA card graphics card drivers because I know a lot of you are getting this LSD graphics card driver bug which makes your card look like it's on drugs. Basically the whole screen is all multicolored and doesn't look right. To start off with you need to click on to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and you need to type in device installation settings then you need to just open that up and we need to go to no your device might not work as expected basically this is going to stop Nvidia automatically downloading graphics card drivers to our machine we then need to go save changes and you now need to head on over to the link that's in the description below and you'll end up on a page that looks like this once you're on this page you need to select the location you're in to download this program just give it five seconds for it to pop up with the save file once it's popped up we can go OK and we can now drag that file to our desktop and we're just going to right click and go extract here and once it's extracted we can now run this .exe just do a backslash and then put ddu and then go extract and as you can see there's a new folder on my desktop called ddu we can now go into that folder and run the display driver uninstaller.exe Once you're on this mode, it will come up and say you're better off running in safe mode. So if you want to run this in safe mode, that is completely up to you. As I'm doing tutorial and recording, I'm just doing it on my main windows. You now need to press OK and we are going to select the clean and restart. Basically what this does is it uninstalls all the current and previous drivers on our machine. It does a nice deep clean on our computer and then it will restart our machine. Right, once your computer has restarted, you now need to head on over to the NVIDIA graphics card drivers website. Once you're on here, you need to type in all your driver details here. As you can see, I've got a 900 series, a 960 GTX and I'm running Windows 10 64 bit. Once you're happy with that, you can now go search and this will find us the latest graphics card driver as you can see there it's version 388 but if this driver gave you grief last time then you don't want to download this driver you want to get the driver before this which was absolutely fine and didn't give you this horrendous LSD bug. Basically, go to the other link that's in the description below and you will end up on a page that looks like this. Once you're on this page, you need to obviously type in your details again for your graphics card and we're going to go start search. And straight away, as you can see, it's got old drivers here, all the way dating back to June the 29th. You can just download the top one or maybe the next one down the second row because you know these drivers were absolutely fine before you got this stupid LSD bug and don't worry it will not automatically update to the latest graphics card driver after installing these as we disable Windows from being able to automatically download the latest drivers once you've downloaded the graphics card driver you want to install we now need to run the setup file and we're going to go OK once that's all finished loading, you now need to go agree and continue. And I recommend you go on to custom. And we're going to go next. Here you can select what you want to install and what you don't want to install onto your Windows. Basically, as you can see here, we've got a graphics card driver, new version and current version. As Windows automatically installed a driver onto my computer whilst doing this tutorial but it's not installed the latest one as you can see it's only installed a version that it had already stored which means that this still will not affect you as this was not the LSD bug version we can obviously deselect um, fission controller driver we can deselect GeForce Experience Physic X as none of these 
we don't really need them as they could be the problem with this bug. They could be what's causing it. I'm not too sure what is actually causing it. But obviously the main thing that you actually really need is the graphics card driver itself. The very top one. So by deselecting these we could very well eliminate the problem. Once you're happy with all this we can now go next. And as you can see it's now installing the latest drivers. And once that's all done, you can obviously deselect these checkboxes here and go close. And hopefully now your computer should be absolutely fine. If it isn't, then redo the steps we did before and try using another different version of Infidia graphics card drivers. I hope this video did help. Hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.